pizza and we got our dad. And I'm gonna, I don't know how I'll do, but I have a pretty good idea of what I'm gonna do today. I feel confident about this challenge here. How do you feel? Not very creative. <laughs> Tell us what we're gonna do today. Um, we're just gonna make the best pizza. Whoever makes the best pizza wins. So what he was trying to say is that we're gonna go to the grocery store. We're gonna pick out ingredients that we want for our pizza. We're gonna cook them, and assuming they're not all disgusting, we might even try each other's to see whose is the best. But ultimately, we're gonna count on you guys voting to determine whose is the best. Originally, I wasn't gonna be in this challenge, but I kinda wanted to be because- He's craving pizza. I kinda wanna make some pizza, and <laughs> it's my last day of summer. <laughs> uh, before they go back to school. So, <laughs> were you gonna say something? And um, I don't like red sauce, so I'm not gonna try your guys's. So we'll see how it goes. We're excited. We're gonna go to the grocery store. We're gonna get some supplies, and then we will be back once we have all of our stuff and we start making our pizza. Is that right? Yes. Keegan, yeah. you look you look focused. Are you ready? Focus. You ready to win this? Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> all right. We'll be back, Slime Squadron. grocery store we're gonna pick out our ingredients you guys ready yeah it's bright and we're only gonna get like for pizza sauce we're only gonna get one or for like pizza we're probably not gonna get three different pizza rolls because that'd be a little pizza much rolls. yeah i can assure you we're not getting any pizza rolls oh, <clears> but thingies. pizza doughs is what she's trying to say okay let's do this Okay, so apparently me and Keegan have the same idea, which is fine. But we're gonna, I'm making a barbecue pizza, apparently he is no, too. No, I have a good idea. Never mind, he's got a better idea. But I'm, get, I'm doing a, I'm doing a barbecue sauce pizza, and honestly, I'm gonna go with what I know is good. It's simple, it's cheap, and it's, yes, yeah, one of these. Boom. This is what I need tonight. You're gonna do that as the sauce? On no, the pizza? as the topping. Oh, I like it. Well, uh, what I'm thinking of making is a nacho pizza. Okay. Like a spicy nacho pizza. I don't think they have what I want. Look on the other side. They have what I want. I want the garlic. Okay. Oh, this. Is that the kind of sauce you want? Yeah. Keegan, what about you? I'm not using tomato sauce. I'm using nacho cheese. Okay, so we got three different types of sauce right now. We got barbecue sauce. We're gonna get nacho cheese for him, and Riley has her white sauce. No one's going with the traditional red. I'm gonna use the nacho cheddar cheese sauce. I need this for my sauce. Because if I use this for the sauce, it's the perfect thing for my nachos pizza. Okay. cheese that I need. This is perfect, exactly what I'm looking for. A mix between mozzarella and cheddar. Although I could really use sharp cheddar to be honest with you. Um, exactly what you need. Are you getting that? I might use some yeah. of that. Yeah. Okay. Okay guys, so um, I need olive oil for the pizza and um, I got it so they can use it. Okay guys, for the spices. I'm gonna get a mini one. I got the mini garlic salt. Now all I need is pizza dough and I'm good. Okay, I'm going with the pre-made crust because this is thin. I want thin. Honestly, I wish it was even more thin than this. But this is gonna work. I'm doing the same thing. Thin to win, right? Yeah, but I also have to find some um, chips and like beans. I'm not gonna get pre-made, I'm gonna make my own, so I'm gonna go get that. I need some chips, very bad. So if you're having nachos, you need chips. But what chips? These. These right here, so these are 
grab these and boom. Okay, I need black beans. But what brand is the best? It even says best. It has to be the best. All right, I found my chicken right here, grilled chicken breast. Now I need to find some microwavable bacon that's pre-cooked. I don't want the real thick stuff. I just want something that'll go good on pizza. Last thing I need, my pre-cooked bacon. This right here is gonna win the win the thing. Yeah, it's not gonna work, maybe, I don't think. I might need a bigger pan. Actually, you just go like that. Make some parts a little weird. What do I do now? <laughs> I think I had olive oil. That's why I got olive oil, guys. You were like, olive oil on pizza? Well, yes. yes. Touch up whatever this is, and I don't know how much to add. Back it. Okay. Now I think I just get it everywhere. You know, I'm not a professional cook, but then at the same time I am. Me. Things as if the olive oil. Now I think I add garlic salt. I'm not a professional cook, so I'm get ooh, I have to pour no, we're not gonna do that. I like garlic salt pizza a lot, so don't judge me if I had a lot. Now I'm gonna pop it in the oven. Probably should go for the smaller one, but it's gonna work. All right, everybody, I'm back. I got my stuff. Um, there's a couple things you probably didn't see. Number one, I stole a couple of Riley's things for a minute, just some olive oil, maybe a little bit of garlic salt. But the other thing I grabbed at the grocery store is this Tapatio. This will go on after, but I still have it. I got my barbecue sauce, I got my cheese, I got my chicken, I got my bacon, and I'm gonna use some of Keegan's sharp cheddar too. Um, sharp cheddar cheese. So first, I gotta get this open. Whoops, see if I can get this thing open here. I went with a different crust than Riley. I have the pre-made, easy to use crust. So I'll put bowl a little bully. bowl bully or whatever, throw some olive oil on there, just a tad to make everything stick. I love olive oil, good for you and it's just good. There's nothing wrong with olive oil at all. Now that I have that layer on there, do a little bit of garlic salt, just a tad. Boom. Done. Now, I got to go with the sauce, not cheese, sauce. Sweet Baby Ray's, cheap and easy. And good. Tastes great. Doesn't taste great, it tastes so I'm a heavy on the sauce, light on the cheese kind of guy. In case anybody at home is wondering, you never skimp out on the sauce. Too much cheese can ruin a pizza sometimes, but sauce, no such thing. I have to disagree. Boom. We can 
spray that around a little bit. It actually looks pretty good to begin with. It's got a spray thing on it or a little squeeze tube thing. But that looks good. That looks real good. So now that we have our sauce on there, get a little bit all around the edges too. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, now cheese. Starting off with a little mozzarella cheddar mix, which is good to start. It's gonna get our base here. Sprinkle this all around. Boom, 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 boom. Good stuff. I don't want to go crazy with this because I'm going to add some sharp cheddar. You say go light on the cheese. That's pretty light. Okay, so that's <laughs> good with that. Hey, can you pass me Keegan's sharp cheddar? I'm just going to borrow a little bit. You don't mind, do you? I don't mind. You also said it on camera. All right. And also, you can have a lot of cheese. Yeah. No, it's not as much as you think. I did. It's a big pizza, though. It's not as much as you think. Boop. Oh my gosh. Boop. Boop, boop, done. Wow. Hand that back to Keegan. Okay, now we add the meat. So we have bacon and chicken. Now this chicken should be pre-cooked, fully cooked, which is good, because you don't want to get sick. You know, if you're gonna put chicken on your pizza, make sure it's pre-cooked. And honestly, it smells good. I'd like to cut these up into pieces. Do we have some scissors or a knife or something? I can kind of break it up with my hands Here too, actually. Don't you have some scissors? Are these clean? Uh, yeah. Yes? Okay. Because I don't know about you, Slime Squad. I like little chunks of chicken. I don't want to go crazy with these big old pieces. Is it cooked? It is cooked. Does it look that cooked? But it will cook more in the oven, which is what we're going for. And honestly, I don't want to load it up full of chicken. Just enough. These few pieces here should be exactly what we need. So it's good. It smells like you're making like a <coughs> like a restaurant. Thank you. A barbecue restaurant. Wow. Allergies. 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 So as you can see guys, we got some chicken pretty pretty well spread out on here. I might do one more piece just to Make sure we cover most of the area here. But again, we don't want to go crazy. That to me looks good. Now, let's bust into some bacon. Again, fully cooked. Bust the bacon. I like this bacon because it's easy to crisp up and cook on top. And it's definitely the last... I don't know what that was. Definitely the last thing that we want to do because it'll get crispy. I think that's our doorbell. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Somebody want to go check our garage doors open, make sure we're good? I will just check the front door. And my hands are slimy from that chicken. It is just a package. Okay. It's Amazon. Prime. Come. More Amazon. We get about five deliveries a day to the house. At least it sometimes seems that way. Okay. That look, that's cooked. That's cooked. But uh, it's going to cook more on top. It looks cooked, but the chicken does not. See, but bacon is good. Bacon is our friend. That looks like snack and bacon. I want to eat my pizza. <laughs> but it's not done. The bacon is really good because it'll crisp up. It goes great with the barbecue sauce. I'm a big fan of this flavor combination. So we'll go with a little bit more bacon here. If my dog was in here, he'd be begging because he loves bacon. That's Mac's favorite food. That's why the curtains are closed. And cheese. We don't so want him to be in be, here. He'd be salivating right now. He would be cooking your pizza. Yes, he would. He, yeah. loves, he loves some barbecue. And cheese and I bacon. hope there's not a tie. That looks really, really good. Honestly, I don't know. It's like, is there ever, is there such thing as too much bacon? Yes. Probably. I think that's good. Yeah, I would not. That is a work of art, people. Look at this pizza. 
Look at that. Delish. Plenty of sauce, bacon, chicken, cheese. Looks wonderful. I'm gonna pop this sucker in the oven. Bottom. Boom, in the oven. Perfection. Okay, so I have to open my Bo Bully pizza. I'm just gonna go like that, just like so. And here it is. Bo Bully. Bo Bo. Okay, so my first step, I gotta put the nacho cheese. Look at this. This is gonna be very good. I'm not gonna lie, that looks good. Mm-hmm. Let me just start getting the cheese on. I'm not gonna go overkill like he did. Okay, that looks very, very good. I'm gonna save the chips for top, so I'm gonna add the beans though. The beans need to cook. Oh, that's a lot of bean juice. Ew, <laughs> a lot of bean juice. How do I drain off this juice? Use a fork. Strainer. Hey, don't worry. Dad's got this under control. Pork will drain your juice. I'll take the spoon. He's a genius! There you go. And boom! It's perfect. Now, it's time to wait for it to cook. Okay guys, my crust has cooked. This doesn't smell too good. But we're going to just spread a little bit. It's okay. kind of smells like a cookie, but that also smells good. Oh, it makes my eyes want to water. Garlic salt. Or not garlic salt. So, now, I don't know if there's a thing of too much garlic on a pizza. So I'm just going to go. There's no such thing. But um, guys, if you guys like um, this sauce, you might want to vote for me. I'm just going to say that because I have a lot of it. I'm trying to not use the whole can on just one pizza, but I might kind of have to. So. I'll give it to you, Riley. That was good thinking of not using free pizza. I don't know if that's good. Should I have more? It's up to you, babe. It looks good, but you can add as much I don't know if it tastes good, so I'm not going to go to where you can't see any pizza, so I think that's good. It okay. also smells good. I kind of want to taste it. Taste test. Ew, that's really like olive oil. I don't know. But now let's add my Yeah, vote for her, guys. <laughs> Now, what kind of, how are you as far as cheese goes, Riley? Not very much. I don't really like it. You're like your dad. But I won't go as. I put less cheese than you. Yeah, you guys, good job. <laughs> you put way too much. I think that's good. I kind of want to try cheese. Do we have a timer set for ours? Hmm. That's good. It looks good, right? I want to add more. Oh, it looks all I think too. Oh, no, I'm good. Yeah. I think I'm done, guys. That's good stuff. Okay. <laughs> um, mine in the oven, and um, let's just wait for them to cook. They're in the oven. We're gonna put them in for eight minutes, give or take, depending on how they look. Hopefully we'll have some beautiful looking pizzas to show you here in a moment. 
Um, so we will we will be back shortly with hopefully three masterpieces, right, guys? Yeah. Yes. I'm right. hungry. I'm hungry too. Mom's pizza. Yum. Yeah, yum. <laughs> Welcome to having celiacs. You can't eat gluten. So there's my pizza, a salad. delicious except that it is time to unravel the bag of chips oh it already is open oh that's convenient <laughs> let's just i think i need a bag i'm gonna put a few in and just crumble it i'm gonna go get a bag <laughs> the chip that was a really weird scream i'm sorry you guys had to hear that while keegan is crunching his chips let's see what aiden's doing I'm broiling mine, so mine's probably fully cooked, but what I'm trying to go for is a little bit more crispiness on top, get some crispy bacon and some golden brown chicken. So I'm now doing a high broil, and I can tell it's starting to take effect. So I'm gonna leave this in for another minute or so, and then hopefully we'll have a work of art here. It's almost done! I also don't wanna choke on so I'm trying to get them into small pieces. Like that, that's perfect. I'm just gonna sprinkle a little on the top. Until it gets sprinkled chips on the top. It looks magnificent. Done. This thing is smoking, it's cooking, it's hot. I'm gonna go set it down. We'll take a closer look. Look out, everybody. Cool, it smells good. Look Are you gonna add your Cholula? Yes. Is that how you say it? Ooh. Yep. A little crispy piece here. What about you? You guys want to come check out my pizza? All right, Keegan. Nice, Keegan. Good job. All right, guys. So I left mine in, got it a little bit crispier. This is a masterpiece here. That's amazing. Cook the chicken till it's golden brown. Got some crispy bacon on there. No. We're gonna see how this thing is. I'm gonna cut this sucker up. Ladies. Okay. So the pizzas are done. It's now time for the best part, which is the taste test. We're gonna let the lady go first. We're gonna try her Alfredo garlic pizza with the home cooked crust. All right, Riley, take the first bite. Let us know what you think. It's actually not bad. Well, actually not bad. Okay. So Alright, Keegan. I'm gonna go with this slice. Mm. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Oh my Wait for you, buddy. All right, Dad, you ready to try yours? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, as you guys can see, I have caramelized barbecue sauce, good looking chicken, bacon all over this bad boy, and, and just for a little bit of heat, I like throwing a little tapatio on here. Tapatio. Gives it some, I already got the sweetness, I got the savory, and now we're gonna go with a little spicy. So, I'll take a little, you know what I'll do? I'm gonna dump some tapatio over here and then dip it, but it's really good. I've had tapatio on pizza before. Good with the crust too. Let's see what we got going on. Let's see what I'm working with here. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. Dad gets messiest pizza award. It's messy, but it's absolutely delicious. Again. Sweet, spicy, savory. Just delicious all the way around. Got some crunch to it from the bacon. Really like this pizza. Really, really like it. Are you guys Are you guys ready to try each other's pizzas? No. I'm almost done with my slice. Why doesn't everybody try one bite of everybody's pizza and you guys can vote for whose you like better? Can I have the crust? No, you can try a bite. Okay. 
Um, awesome. All right, so everybody's gonna try a bite of Keegan's first. Okay. Let's go. So come over here, Dad. I want mm. beans. <laughs> All right. Keegan, let's see what you're working with. I'm gonna try a piece with a little bit more Cholula, because I like Cholula. It's honestly amazing. Mmm. Like the chips give a good crunch. It's like a little spice from the Cholula nacho cheese. Yep, that tastes like a nacho pizza. It's really good. Hey, Aiden, that's nacho cheese. Sorry. <laughs> really good, Keegan. Okay, let Riley have a bite. Okay, I'm just gonna have right here. Lame. I haven't eaten my pizza. Go ahead, hold it. You got it? Yeah. I'm scared. That cheese got a good spice to it, too. Get mm -hmm. some with the cheese on it, Ryan. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Riley's our picky kid. How do you feel about that, Riley? <laughs> Is it spicy? <laughs> All right, moving on to Riley's pizza, boys. I want another pizza. All right, let me try. Let me try. Can I put you Lula? All right, let's give this sucker a try. Mmm. Definitely garlicky. <laughs> You can do that for sure. The Alfredo sauce is not bad. Oh, wait, oh. She's enjoying her pizza. <laughs> mm. Well, it's safe to say Dad doesn't mind Keegan and Riley's pizza. Let's see how they like mine. They're not fans of each other. So everybody come try Dad's pizza now. Mm. Um, oh, grab a piece. You don't need Dad's piece that he already has. Get a plate, oh, this one. Oh, this I can tell. Mm. Oh my gosh. Heaven. You like it? Mm -hmm. All right, Riley. Come take a bite. Oh. I don't think Keegan's sharing that piece. I'm liking this. I'm gonna get this piece because I want to eat there with like not very. Well, you need to try it with everything on it so you can give your honest opinion. I'm not gonna get the chicken. Careful, it's gonna fall. You have to hold it up, Riley. Okay. Um, okay. I'm gonna get it. Oh! Bacon burn. Hot. Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What'd you think? Oh my. Spicy. Yeah. You think? Spicy? It shouldn't be spicy. I'm giving this one to Dad. You think Dad won? Riley, who do you vote for? I'm gonna have to say Dad. But it's so hot. Okay, so both these guys had really, really good pizzas. I have to vote for one of them. Although it's close. I'm actually going to give Keegan the edge on this one and say that nacho pizza was really good. And I give him credit. He gets extra points for creativeness. I just think it's a really creative idea. So, Riley, yours was amazing, too. I love them both. I'm going with nacho. And with me. Goodbye, everybody. Hope you enjoyed our video. Comment below on whose you would like to try. Bye. If you could. Bye. Bye. Bye.